Hi Reception, so this week we started exploring our main character, Traction Man's thoughts and feelings throughout the story and predicting things that he might say. We've learned about speech bubbles, we've had a go at reading speech bubbles and matching them to the right illustrations. Now what we're going to do today is we're going to have a go at writing our own speech bubbles. Now what I've done is I've taken a few of the illustrations from the story that we have already looked at, but instead of trying to match up the ones that I've written, you're going to have a go at writing your own. So you're going to have a look at what's going on in the picture, look at what he's doing, maybe look at his facial expression, what does his face look like, how do we think he might be feeling, and then what do you think he might say while doing that? So have a little think, and you can, chat with your grown-up to come up with ideas, practice saying it in your Traction Man voice if that helps you, and then use your sound cards and your keyword mats to have a go at writing some speech that Traction Man might say in each picture. You've got him there fighting the evil pillows from when they captured all the farm animals. Then you've got when Scrubbing Brush becomes his new pet, when Scrubbing Brush rescues him from that naughty, poisonous dishcloth in the sink. Then there's here, where Traction Man was feeling a little bit sad and a little bit embarrassed in his romper suit that um, the grandma admitted him and he was being laughed at. So have a think about how he might have been feeling there. Then finally, the last page. Now for this one, I've put you could do a speech bubble for Scrubbing Brush here instead if you wanted to. So you can keep going coming up with one for Traction Man for the last one, or if you want to do it for what you think Scrubbing Brush might say here instead, then you can absolutely do that too if you want to practice writing about somebody else. Now the little challenge at the end says, take a photo of yourself or draw a picture of yourself doing something at home that you like doing. So Traction Man likes rescuing people and helping people, doesn't he? So we've been doing speech bubbles for all the different things that he likes doing. So I want to see a speech bubble of you while you're enjoying something that you like doing. So take a picture of yourself, draw a picture of yourself doing something at home that you like doing, then draw a speech bubble coming out of your mouth and write about what you say when you do this thing you enjoy. So I want a picture of you with a lovely big speech bubble coming out of it and you can write to tell me what it is that you would say while you were doing it. Okay, enjoy.